Hi, I'm Lino Rulli, author of the book Sinner. You know, if there's one thing I've studied in my life, if there's one thing I'm sadly very, very knowledgeable about, it's, it's sin, in fact. So I am here to help you sin. Let me rephrase that. I'm not here to help you sin. I'm here to help you learn about sin. Let's see what the question is. Hey, Lino, are there ways to avoid sin? Ways to avoid sin. All right, ways to avoid sin. You know, the, the ironic thing is sometimes people would say, you know, just don't leave the house. Don't leave the house, uh, you'll never sin again. Well, that's not true. Got the TV, you got the internet, there's plenty. You got food, you got drink, you got plenty of ways to sin. I think the best way to avoid sin would be to know what your temptations are and to know what your weaknesses are. That's the best way to avoid sin. Because if, if I know myself well enough to know where I'm going to be really tempted and where I'm not going to be tempted at all, then uh, the whole idea of avoiding the near occasions of sin are to avoid the things that are going to be occasions of sin for you and for me, and those two things might be different. So the one thing you don't want to be is a Catholic ostrich. Don't try to put your head in the sand and think, well, I'm going to avoid the world, I'm going to avoid everything in life, because you still got yourself, and there's plenty of opportunities for sin right there. So the best way to avoid sin is to know thyself, know your weaknesses, and in times of temptation, Ask God's help. You can always go to God, you know, because God's not a huge fan of sin either. Trust me, I know, because, well, I'm always apologizing for my sins. I'm Lino Rulli, author of the book, Sinner.